Hey guys, so today's video is on metadata. But what is metadata? Metadata is basically any data about another piece of information or data. Um, examples of that include the location, the file size, the date that a photo or text file uh, or some other piece of data was created. Um, an example of this is if a hacker got a picture of someone, um, he could extract metadata from that photo and he could find out the location where they were when they took that photo. So for today's um, tutorial and demo, I'm going to be extracting metadata from a photo using a tool called EXIF tool. Um, I'm going to be extracting that metadata and I'm going to be changing some of the metadata. So this is the photo that we're going to be using for today. It's a picture of me doing a split jump somewhere in the world. We're going to see by the end of this video if I can find out where I was. So let me close that. Let me open up PowerShell. I'm just going to go into the directory where that photo is in. I'm going to just first, right off the bat, run an EXIF tool on that photo. So that's the name of it. I'm just going to run it. And we can right away see that we get a lot of information back. Um, we can see the phone that it was taken on. It was an iPhone 7. We can see the altitude it was taken at. It was above sea level. We can see the file creation when it was taken. But the thing I'm interested in right now is the GPS position. So we're just going to copy this. We're going to go to my browser. And we're going to go to Maps. So if I go to Google Maps and paste this in. At first, Google doesn't recognize it because I need to clean some of the stuff up. I need to add a degree sign. So I'm just going to search up the degree symbol. I'm just going to copy this really quick. And instead of the word degrees, I'm going to be putting the degree symbol. I'm going to be deleting some of the spaces to make it easier to see and read. And if I click enter, we can see when I scroll out, I was at the tip of Europe. I was in Spain at Gibraltar and I was at the Rock of Gibraltar. Um, and we can see the exact location. I was pretty high up. I was over here, but that was exactly where I took the photo. Um, so some of the stuff I'm going to change is I'm just going to change the copyright. So right now the copyright says that it is where's the copyright copyright it says that it's made by Apple I can actually add or change some of the data and I'm going to change the copyright to be cyber Shaolin. so let me just run exif tool dash copyright that's the tag I'm going to be changing copyright is equal to and I'm going to change it to cyber Shaolin. and I'm going to be doing it on that image so when I click enter you can see the file is updated, and if I just run the same exit tool on the photo again, that when I go and check the copyright, where's copyright? It says Cyber Shaolin. So that's all for today's video, guys. If you like that video, be sure to give this video a like. Or if you like this video, be sure to give it a like, uh, subscribe, and check out cybershallon.org for more videos and hands-on learning.